Hi. <laughs> Um, my name is Mylan Kaufman, and I'm a senior at Omaha Central. Old school! <laughs> and this is my poem called 11818, Not Better, Just Different. <clears throat> Mom jeans look like defeat. Mom jeans smell like Abercrombie and Fitch. He likes mom jeans, he likes mom jeans, he likes mom jeans. Mom, can we go to JCPenney? <laughs> mom jeans feel like a comfort zone everyone is in but me. Mom jeans taste like morning breath I didn't eat last night. Mom jeans, mom jeans, mom jeans, why? <laughs> Am I crying over mom jeans? She's cute, I'm sure she's adorable. Are they ripped, dark wash, light wash, rolled up, thrifted, Danzig is a city. Why don't I have? <laughs> any mom jeans. I'm obsessive. I can't wear mom jeans because of the outline of my stomach. I can't wear mom jeans because my legs are too short and my torso is too long. It's called washing Maslow hierarchy. I can wear mom jeans. They need to be huge, slightly ripped, and I'll wear them with Converse. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> This isn't about him anymore. This is about my obsession with how I don't exist, right? I need to lose weight, she says. No, you don't. Where did you get your mom jeans? <clears throat> 450 is money, 450 is years. I learned that in fourth grade. I exist wrong, five, seven, fat. Men are afraid to catcall me. Don't get me wrong, I'm not complaining, but I know girls who have guys confessing their love for her left and right to an insecure, touch star. That's so, it would be so much better. Sorry, I mean different. It would be so different to have men at my disposal. I can't help but envy them and their mom jeans. Update, three weeks later, I got a pair of mom jeans that night and he didn't even look at me. <clears throat> Did you think I'd be hurt? You were right. <laughs> Forgive or take three hours. These thoughts I have at midnight don't define me, and I probably will obsess over something trifling again, but I will never let my pants size make me write a poem again. Woo!